jewelry store on hard solo i don't know if this is like a known glitch or bug or something and this is after the 25.1 patch or update or whatever so i can move my hostages around which is what i did i stealth mission I tied up four civilians outside shot two who i couldn't reach because i shot you know scared them too early i couldn't reach them to time up got the patrolling guard out the back got the guard inside answered the pages fine um I think I tied up one dude out the back of the shop and sort of got the other two people who wandered out the back of the shop, told them to get on the ground, cracked the safe, and there was two jewellery boxes in there, you know, to make bags out of, and a couple of bots of cash, so I got them, chucked them out the alley, the left alley, and uh, got the rest of the jewellery out of the cases. So basically what I'm trying to say is I didn't like do any glitches, I didn't do anything weird or strange, I didn't try any hack. But anyway, yeah, nobody called the cops, got all the bags out and into the van. By the time I put the last bag in the van, another civilian I think spawned outside. So I don't know if there's like a time delay after you get the mission bags in and then another, you know, outside civilian spawns in the streets or something perhaps. But yeah, so I climbed in the back of the van and he's just like, oh, I got a split, or whatever it is he says. And uh, yeah, so the van took me out of the map and I ended up in this weird place. Where the van guy is just parked up. <coughs> in the middle of this police raid, and I can see him all over there. One piece of small advice I would give is to use your primary weapons on single shot mode. In case you don't already just because it's a lot more accurate, you only need one headshot on hard at least, I can see here to pop helmets off the cops it just saves on so much more ammo and it's a good practice to adopt especially when you get into the harder difficulties and you're a real pro and you need to save all your ammo or you don't because you've got a teammate who's got the ammo bags or something like that but you know, it, it's good, uh, good team play really you don't want to be using up all the ammo bags if we just fast forward this bit here, I'm just testing my sort of infinity theory and showing you guys how it, what actually happens if you get stuck here and jump through these cars for future reference. But yeah, so I've jumped off here, <coughs> respawned straight back in the street. Can't, you know, I don't have an explanation for that. Kill these, but I figure. If you just jump off, it takes you back to the nearest piece of land, you know, piece of safe land that you just jumped off. So I'm like, okay, let's just give it a shot. Jump closer to there, maybe it'll take us around the corner. And -da 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 -da. it did, in fact, get me back into the level with a smidge of health and enough ammo to uh, and determination take out the rest of these cops and make a good getaway so hopefully this video managed to help you if you did get stuck <coughs> in wherever the van takes you